In this tutorial, you will learn how to add a cover and fasteners to a solid edge assembly using the bottom-up approach. First, click on the Solid Edge Application button and from the Open menu, Browse. From the list at the bottom of the dialog, select Assembly Documents, then select the Brake Pedal Assembly file from the Training folder. Now, use the Quick View Cube to orient the view so that it is easy to view the parts required to assemble the cover. Then slide open the Parts Library tab from the Edge bar and pin it using the Auto Hide button. Press the Home button to navigate directly to the Brake Pedal Assembly folder. Locate the cover component and right-click in an empty space to display the preview if it was not already visible. Next, use the Shift and Right Mouse button combination to orient the cover part so that it is in the desired orientation. Then drag and drop the cover component into the assembly. From the command bar, open the Relationship Types drop-down and select Mate. Use the Quick Pick menu to select the bottom face of the cover. Then select the top face of the bracket in the assembly. Select Axial Align from the command bar and set the near side hole on the cover. Then select the corresponding hole on the bracket. Repeat the process to add an Axial Align relationship to the far side hole. The cover is now fully positioned in the assembly and is added in the Pathfinder. Now select the cover in the Pathfinder and check each relationship in the Relationship Collector. Locate the screw in the Parts Library and drop it in the assembly. Select Mate from the command bar and pick the flat face of the screw. Now select the top face of the cover to add the relationship. Select Axial Align from the command bar and pick the cylindrical portion of the screw. Then select the hole on the cover. On the command bar, Click Lock Rotation. Right-click to apply. Right-click again to finish the command. Next, select the screw and start the pattern command. Select the cover part to use its whole pattern. Then select the pattern on the cover part. Click Finish on the command bar to create the assembly pattern of the screw. This completes the tutorial for adding a cover and fasteners to a solid edge assembly using the bottom-up approach. In this tutorial, you learned how to use the parts library and orient part before assembling, how to add assembly relationships like mate and axial align, and how to pattern parts at assembly level using an existing pattern in a component.